Hello and welcome to episode 103 of our Midlands map. Goodness me, it, it's Walsall well again. Yes, but it, it's about finished for now. During the rest of the series, I will just keep adding bits to it and we'll look at anything I add. Probably once it's uh, towards a very, a very complete state. It, it's doing all right now. The car park's had a bit of a makeover. How's everybody doing? We're all looking forward to Transport Fever 2. I say that because I definitely am. So, with that in mind, and it's getting ever closer, isn't it? That this is uh, this is the state of Walsall right now. It's it's got a car park. It's got some cars in it. Actually, we bring we can bring up the UI, can't we? We can see the date has moved on about six months. No, five months. Do some math. Yeah, we've moved on five months. And I've the reason I've done that is, as you can see, they're building back. I destroyed Walsall quite a bit, but I did leave did leave a few areas for them to keep building. We now have a bus depot or a bus station. We don't have the one that's there. It's kind of a oval covered thing, but you know this this will work when it that'll do. And I've kind of improvised with this one, this road going through here should be pedestrian only but given that we're probably condensing roads down three or four roads into one i thought this would uh, this would work and then we've got a little little bus shelter depot -y place like <laughs> it's not a depot it's a bus it's a bus station yeah bus stop there you go stop calling it a depot um this might upset walsall fans out there <laughs> that's that's as much as i could get in I did try fitting the stadium in, which would have been one one decent upgrade. What's actually happened, though, is you've had a bit of a downgrade in your stadium. So that's the new Bescot, not stadium. Well, I mean, we've got a stand here of sorts. You've kind of gone back in time, haven't you? And, uh, well, you've got a clubhouse as well. Maybe they do some nice sandwiches in there. <laughs> Who knows? Yeah, so there we go. There's Walsall. We've got a train that's just appeared i have uh i have been doing some serious research i've tried to condense all the varied services that run through walsall up to rugely some of them some of them turn around here obviously and and picked kind of a three okay ones i would say for those that don't know when i pick the train services that represent real life i tend to go for any of the services between nine and eight and six so nine in the morning and six in the in the early evening so what do you reckon that that's walsall it, it's not bad and if we just take a look around here the m6 has has been squeezed in just now i know some of you are interested to see what i do with bescott yard what i've done is put some placeholders in so i could try and figure out if the m6 would fit firstly and then we've got uh, Bescott Stadium Station. And then it heads up to that way. You'll see when we, we should be okay to hook up that way into, uh, into Wolverhampton over there. But what are we doing today? Well, since we have uh, the, the, the station in, and I promised we'd do a little bit on the maintenance side slash... <laughs> look, they're already trying to build straight into the... And the... Uh, new services as as well as taking a look at the new plane we we'll, might sort of put i don't know what we're doing with this station i had i had a suggestion which was a good one and that is combine tambridge parkway with uh hampstead because that's going to be a it's going to be too close we've still got to, oh, do, like, do you know what we could do this couldn't we we need to connect this up this is this is something that hasn't happened so, uh, not that. We need to go into here. Yes, we do like catenary. At the moment, this bit doesn't have catenary, but it will soon. This is going to have to do something like that. And then we're going to need to connect up and make that little section. How's that looking? Oh, bit laggy. Not surprising. There's a lot going on. I would say that is okay for us. What actually happens, though, is there's another section that goes like this. And for a little way, it is... Did you see that lag? It is uh, 
three tracks and then comes back in and then uh, continues off like that and this one does something something like that close enough there we go that'll do won't it that'll do what we could do actually is change this bit since it's tech i don't know whether it's unused or whether it's used for freight bypass oh no i didn't want to do the whole lot could we not do the whole lot there we go you can hold shift and select which sections you want to put in let's get rid of the mold hills for a second ah that's better oh that's the remnants from our initial bridge isn't it <laughs> yes it is that didn't go too too fantastically right then there we go official episode and everything all done in about the first five minutes that's brilliant we're, we're on a roll today that's because we've got to get a lot in uh the we've got to electrify this for a start haven't we i just realized yes we stop there i'm glad this section is electrified now because that could have proved quite an issue as they are class 101s i still didn't do this i've still got to do that although they haven't built back there at the moment maybe we just let them have the sneaky house buried in in the foundations of the station there right let's up uh, let's upgrade uh this section of track it's just going to be high speed and with catenary for now uh, we're left i'm going to have to check whether there are actually crossovers there and there we go now that i know that's probably correct and uh, do you know that might be there can we upgrade that we can if we use it like that i believe there we go we got it in lovely can we make it high speed as well that would be beautiful excellent we, we've upgraded guys we've upgraded this is perry bar which for a lot of our services is going to be used i was informed did i ever finish my sentence about uh, combining stations possibly not i'll reiterate just in case i didn't yeah i'm this is what you get when you've sort of planned it but then you go thinking ahead of yourself while recording see while i was talking to you just then i was saying one thing thinking completely different things such as how on earth am i going to make this fit yes the uh, the stations we're going to no i did say it Hampstead and Tambridge Parkway are going to be combined I believe into one similar to what we did over at university because all the stops are on top of each other there as well that gives us quite a bit of room to play with and have a real good go at uh, an abbreviated Bescott uh, yard here I do want to bring stuff in and out of Bescott looking at it I don't know whether it's ballast one's on Sandy Lane it's kind of around here and it does look like sand there aptly named and this one looks like it's got a whole ton of ballast behind it it's it's entirely possible that what well, that's what that's for get your words out nice and early this is the m5 and it's supposed to split into the m6 i thought this was the m6 but it's not uh, what confuses me is the m6 is gonna come around here obviously and plow straight through here <laughs> because we're missing a huge chunk just here which is a spaghetti junction you'll see it is there yeah no it's fine leave that alone what <laughs> i should have connected it up really please don't crash when i do this oh i'm a little bit nervous can we uh, can we slide a can we slide a road in it would be great there we go we're gonna have to somehow fit some sort of works yard there aren't we pickup point we can do it we can do it it's, it's gonna be right near the football ground that's all right we could have uh, one of the less less imposing ones uh, such as not that we could have something like that i don't know whether that will fit in probably not that large maybe just with two. Oh, we can get a little little slide going on there do you know what that might work well, if we take that out that will give us a better place for a no not that that will give us a bit better place for a junction you almost fit perfectly give it a bit of a slide towards the <laughs> towards the football stadium there we go i'm all excited because we've got things going if we just do that 
I kind of take it. Yes. Yeah, no, I'll take that. That should access this yardy place here and here. Not that we're going to be dropping anything off at the station. Or you never know. This is kind of working, isn't it? We've got to try and squeeze some tracks in. It, like I said, it's going to have to be abbreviated. It's almost there. It's almost there. About as close as we're going to get, I think. I haven't quite done this right. It should really slide that way. I don't know how, how that's going to work. But we'll get around to it. But the starts are there. What do you reckon? Are you happy? I'm happy with that. I, I feel like we're going to get the other one there. The only bit I'm a bit concerned about. Should we give it a go? Is, is getting this up here. We're going to use a large country road as a city road. Do you know this is going to crash, isn't it? Go on, go up there. Just connect in. <laughs> just, just straight off connect in. That would have been perfect. Uh, if we can, I wouldn't mind it. Being able to go over the top. Maybe. If we shift and give it a little bit of a hump back. Or a lot of a hump back. Give it that one. Yes. I mean, it's going to dance around a bit. We might be able to get away with it. All right, if we leave that in as the junction, it's not it's not pretty, but it might work. I mean, it's supposed to be a, a sort of flyover anyway, so yes. All right, we'll leave that in as a junction for now. I just thought, Transport Fever 2. We're going to have a, a much better time of it, aren't we? When it comes to uh, road junctions. Because we get one-way streets. So we can have proper motorways. Yes. Look at how busy this little this little uh, main road is. Oh, that's lovely. You're quite busy, aren't you? You're all off to watch the football. I don't know. Is there any th Thursday night football? What it'll be. Lovely. Okay. Stop dilly-dallying. All right, then. Let's get on with it. We need to... We need to get rid of our remaining steam train. But I think... What we should do first we're going to leave this like this do you think that would be a good plot actually it might be if we put this as tambridge parkway slash hamstead it'll be fairly accurate we got rid of that bridge again i wonder if that dude was coming back from work <laughs> it's like seriously could you stop deleting that road that's the only way i can get to work we're gonna to have to pause that right let's see uh let's just put in a, a small station uh, you won't find it there. That's depots. Get up to here. We just want something very simple. That is less than simple. Uh, 100 meters should do us. 110 on the height. 110, 1,100. None of that. We want to take off everything else as well. No, I said take it off. None, none. This stops it lagging while we get the positioning correct. Uh, nothing on the main building. We can put it both sides, I think, given what we're doing. Both in the middle. And then we'll connect it up there. Possibly there. We might need to give it a little bit of a curve, even though technically it doesn't. But I'm, I'm down with giving it a bit of a curve. If we just send it round there and help it on its way. 2,000 should be enough. That's kind of nice. It's almost flowing with the track. What about 1,000? A little bit over the top. We'll tidy it up once it's in. Okay then, what else don't we want? Oh, we should put some fences on. Let's put some fences on. Let's make sure the tracks are high speed with catenary. And if you go there, I think we're in a good place. Get rid of this. Let's make it nice and smooth, the transition. Almost like we just slotted it in. Can't see any speed issues. There we go. So this is probably going to be called Hampstead. But we need to call it Tambridge slash Hampstead. There we go. That should do it, shouldn't it? That'll be fine. And we're going to have a little bit of issues here. But we can knock this back. You're, you're sort of going to get a con connection. I believe the road we should use is the, the one at the end of Tambridge, possibly. That should work for us. We can just have it going across like that. Oh, you might need to come this way. There we go. If we have it like that how high is that please go straight that's awful it's not bad it's a bit messy uh oh there we go we've we've got a bit it's a bit high isn't it we don't need it that high C can you uh oh i don't know actually we'd need we'd need to see the bridge 
let's let's do it with this and change it to something like that. That's way too high. Don't need it that high. Can we just shift page down a little bit? Try that. And if we get it across, we should be able to. All right. Yep. I'm going for it. We'll use our uh, our little trick where we lower the lower the ground around the side of the track and then that way we might be able to squeeze it in might fingers crossed this guy up here will not only get access to Tambridge slash Hampstead but will also get a bridge so he'll be all sorts of happy as long as this doesn't crash or anything crazy like that we might be a bit low there Oh, do you know, that, that's really cutting through the catenary, isn't it? <laughs> I went a bit crazy on the on lowering it. Come on. You know you want to do it. Oh, I, I missed the zoom. There we go. Oh, it, it, it couldn't be any closer. It couldn't be any closer. You're beautiful. You're going to get in like that. Can we uh, make it a bit more of an angle? That's beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, I love it. I love it. Right, you're going to go there, then you're going to go across there. I don't know how we're getting up here. We're going to have to do some sort of some sort of crazy path, aren't we? Go like that. I mean, it's it's probably more representative of a a pedestrian walkway rather than rather than a road. We'll accept it. Smooth that out a touch. I don't know what we're doing with it yet, but we do want it connected. It would be nice. It would be nice. This is going to have to go this way, isn't it? If we do that, we could make some cool little gradual lift on it. Now, let's connect this road up into there. And then we'll connect this up and make sort of a little roundabout thing. Yeah, not the best. We'll work on that. Or I will, definitely. But for now, just for a connection for them. And then they can possibly start building back up. I mean, they are going to be Tambridge too, aren't they? All the smoothing today. Goodness me. Super official. All right, we'll get that done. We'll we'll stop them from doing this as well. Absolutely. In fact, ooh, I say that. I would like them to stay there. I don't know whether it will help them or not. But it might encourage them to keep building across the road. Which would be rather nice. They're not going to do it the most elegant, that's for sure. But what they might do is get a foothold over the other side. Where is the center? Yeah, because there's the center. They tend to build from the center around. Uh, they will lean towards public transport, but there has been no public transport this side. There has been that side. It, it was up to here. But I believe all this is... No, that might be Hansworth. This would be Hansworth. Hansworth, I don't know where is growing. Where are you growing, Hansworth? Have you kind of merged into... I don't know. You've got a bit... You've got a bit upset with me, haven't you? I don't know why you've got brilliant access to the entire network. Dear, oh dear. Well, this... This could link up, couldn't it? Absolutely. Why not? And then that could be the end of that. We are missing some bridges slash tunnels, so we need to get those in at some point. But it's all about the rail network primarily. Eventually, it will be about the fences. Although I will say, I'm going to save. Oh, I nearly knocked my tea over. That would have been a disaster. <laughs> I can't help but, but laugh about it, though. Dear, oh dear. <laughs> that would have been awful. I don't know why that tickled me so much. Okay. Right, we've got all that in. Let's let them build back. Let's hit play. Hopefully it doesn't doesn't die on me. We're going to need to electrify this, aren't we? This section. Or are we? Oh no. Well, yeah, because we, we do head back in here. And this is electrified. Or do diesels only use that? We are going to make use of it. There is a train that goes in here. Right, but first. I'm not taking a selfie. But first, I can't, every time I say that now, I can't get, let me take a selfie out of my head. Let's, let's replace a train. I want to replace the final 
I believe we've only got one more steam train running. Let's go to the line manager a second. Oh, I was gonna, I was gonna extend it. That doesn't happen. And oh, you can't sort by freight, can you? No, no, you can't. That's fine. I did notice. Did you see the new UI in in the the final thing? Uh, that's amazing. I mean, you can search for a line name, but it doesn't matter if you have not called them freight, <laughs> which I I don't really. There we go. It's this one, I believe, is going to have another one of our class 58s. I'm just checking. I wondered what these were. I was like, did I start something? But this is our exits, isn't it, from the uh, from the depots? Kind of like that. Look at all of our stuff we've got. We've got a steam train from Worcester to Whitlock's End. That's brilliant. Hey, that's fantastic. There's a little shunter. Oh, that's wonderful. Oh, there's our little uh, Starbridge Junction train. There's your, there's your uh, HSTs. We've got quite a few now. That's nice. What else have we got? We've still got a steam train there. But we're doing freight. You're not sticking a 58 on the front of a passenger train. I'm just checking that that's the only freight train. Yes. Okay, we're going to do this one. How many vehicles do we have on? Just the one. Ooh, the sound. The sound. Okay, we'll bring that up then. Let's turn that down a bit in my headphones. Not for you guys. Unless it is loud for you, which I won't know. Let's zoom down here. That's not the one I was meant to do. It's supposed to be this one. While we're watching this, it, it is a fantastic model, isn't it? The reworked one by Killer Cans. Killer Cans is working on something new. And I'm sure he'll drop a comment below, but it looks it's looking like it might be on this map when he finishes it. But anyhow, yes, I have I don't remember ever finishing an episode with this sort of view. That would be kind of cool, wouldn't it? It's a bit different. Like a, a fly with a train. I mean, there's a lot of scenery. It's kind of beautiful. Get on with your replacements. You're waffling. So, what are we doing with this? Oh, if we pause it, that's going into this station up here, isn't it? Just up there, yeah. So, if we just pause that, we'll get our Class 58. We're going to have it in EWS. It's uh, the steel. I believe it's the same wagons replacement let's get rid of you unfortunately and replace now you can't send it out like that you, you can't just send out a bunch of wagons yes there we go ews let's get you on there we're gonna get rid of the brake car we're gonna possibly go a little low length wise we're gonna go over a little over length wise go over yep that's what you're listening for <laughs> dear oh dear I see, I'm excited. I can't hide it. I'm I'm super excited. Not just for Transport Fever 2, but that we're we're finally gonna get a connection to uh to Birmingham from Walsall and Wolverhampton as well. It's gonna be the the whole Bermuda Triangle. That's not what it is. Oh we got these state cars. I kind of prefer these. They're 24, these are 26. And it says not about the length, unfortunately. I always forget that. It doesn't tell you the length, does it? So we're just going to stick one of those on the back. That's 206. I think that'll do us. There you go. Replace now. Let's hit play. And we'll, we'll go back to following it. Like so. I like this view. We could hide the UI. Not that We're not finishing. We're not. Oh, I like it. We've got the other freight train. Another EWS. As we look over into... Uh, oh, as we cut into that as well. It's fine. <laughs> we look over to... Where would that be? Rugby. Of course it was rugby. We can spin around and watch the uh, dancing smoke. I love it. We're going to say goodbye to it. But I feel like this... This uh, this loco will make a return, and it will be as a probably a rail tour type thing with a with a diesel on the back, probably a class forty seven. You get top and tailed by two of Killer Kansas <laughs> locos. There we go. That'll be perfect. 
All right. Do not crash, because we made some changes. I, I should, I should save it. No, we're good. So there we go. We got a, a class 58 in EWS livery. He's picking up 312. I wonder what his, uh, wonder what his stats are. Mediocre. No, that's fine. On a really high gradient, he'll he'll still manage 31 miles an hour eventually. You know, in a year. <laughs> There's that sound. Oh, you can hear the clicking. I just realised. That's fantastic. But there it is. Totten Traction Depot. He looks alright, doesn't he? I like him. He's going to turn round as another freight, freight train. Plenty of freight around rugby. That's, that's legit. Oh, I like the uh, I like the dirty bogies under there. That's fantastic. So there we go. We now have class 58s. They look s smaller, a lot smaller than the the 47s. That's interesting. I don't know whether that's to scale or whether or it's just a little off scale. No, maybe, maybe. I don't think they use these at all in the UK anymore. So this is a... Oh, bye. This is a little blast from... Blast from the past. I believe they're in... Uh, they're in storage. There's a few in storage. They were shipped... Shipped abroad. And there's not many in service abroad either. But yeah, I was reading up on it. Not fully. And it was a while ago, but I had a good read. There we go. Right, that was our last. Uh, that was our last steam train. It's it's a shame to say goodbye, isn't it? They will return, I promise. Okay, what else can we do? I'm gonna save it. That's what that's what we're gonna do. All right, we're saved. I can breathe a little easier then once it's saved. There we go. We've got about 15 minutes left. We're gonna put in a plane, and then we're gonna put in a new service. I believe this one, Cosford to Birmingham International. Now, is this... Yeah, this is what I would like to be. A... a An American Airlines 757. Yes. Yeah, let's do that. Replace now. Because then that represents, say, planes coming in from the US. I don't know. I don't even know whether they stop at Birmingham International. But we, we don't have much going on. It's not like we've got London on the map or anything. Manchester. What's that plane there? We do have one, don't we? What? The one going to East Midlands Airport is a, is a Boeing as well. Which one is it? Is it a Boeing? No. No, it's not. It's a Comet. Brilliant. Okay, so now we've got a 747. 757, not 47. I'll forever say that. Oh, yes, Derby. I'm lost, guys. Can you tell? I went scooting up there. And uh, what I need to be doing is finding... Birmingham International. There's Kingsbury. We're getting close. There's Coal End. Here we go. Yeah, I can almost hear the planes. We're, the, we're there. We're there. What, what plane's this taking off? Is that the Boeing? It is definitely not. And it's looking a bit beaten up. <laughs> oh, that's going to... To Nottingham. Yes, absolutely. That makes a lot of sense. Uh, vehicles. What are these? They're the 737. So we've got 737s and 747s every time. I don't know where he is though. Let's, let's, uh, this one. Let's find the vehicle. Where are you? Are you landing? I think you're landing, aren't you? Oh, it's perfect. You're perfect. You get in there. We'll come back, take a look at him. Or I can press fast forward. Because it's nearly 1985. I don't know whether anything happens. There we go. Look, he's on turbo mode. I don't know where, whether anything happens in 1985. Whether there's any new vehicles. But we might as well speed it up. Ooh, you're a bit, a bit laggy, aren't you? Okay. We're going to get to see the 747. Finally. 57. Oh. Oh, there he goes. He's just, uh, he's just taking off. He's, he was doing a wheelie there, weren't he? 
You see the flaps and everything. Look at that. They do they do adjust, don't they, the flap? I don't know whether you can see the engine jet spinning. It'll be a bit that would be a bit excessive, wouldn't it? Well, right, here we go then. Ooh, that sounds good. Bit of shadow issues. We're up. Oh, the wheels are gone. The flaps are going to stay, I believe. What's it sound like? We haven't had a go in a plane in a little while, although there's nothing going on, is there, over this side of the map, typically. Although we're heading here. We are definitely heading here. Now that sound, I'm going to enjoy listening to, if we can hear it. You can hear the rumble. I love it. I love it. Okay. Should we, uh, should we finally extend? Extend? Where are, we? Where are we? I've lost us. I've lost us, guys. We're going to extend this one first. This is just going to be the one... It would be the one that goes to London Euston and splits at... Now, some split at uh, Birmingham International, technically. I noticed on on the timing on the timetables that they say portion one goes to blah de blah say portion one goes to crew and the other one goes to Rugeley Trent Valley unfortunately we can't split trains or join trains so we're gonna improvise and this will be the Birmingham New Street slash Birmingham Euston one of the portions <laughs> yes that's what I'm going with I mean, mostly they go to Birmingham International, but we're gonna we're gonna represent that a little bit. Oh my word! Oh, good night, guys, guys! Look at it all. Class one five zero, class three one eight, class one four two, and then. A million more. Now what? What a wait. <laughs> We're towards the end of the episode. Now what? You can't do that to me, game. Well, you can, because that was brilliant. Did you see all of that? Oh, I'm excited. But we've got to do this. Right. Focus on this. I, I guess we're going to have a more of an episode next next week, where we, we come back to trains, because... Oh, I want to hear in the comments below. You saw them all. <laughs> if not, you're going to have to pause it or something. Because <laughs> there were loads. Have a think about where you want those trains to go and drop a... Because you you know all the lines. We've got tons of lines going on. We'll, we'll probably have a quick look through the passenger lines. Right, okay. You're distracted completely now. Let's get... Uh, not physical. Let's get trains running from Walsall... Well, that's where we go up to now. This is going to be the Birmingham Euston slash not. Right, from... Oh, hang on. Stop that a second. From Walsall. You want to then go to Bescott Stadium. That is right. And then to Tainbridge slash Hampstead. Now, do we want to send this around? We might. We might. This one goes to... So this one just only goes to Tambridge and then straight to Birmingham. I am tempted to send it round here eventually. However, I don't think we can do that. This literally just goes straight to Birmingham New Street. Then it comes back out to Tambridge and then to Bescott and then to Walsall. It won't like it. Why is that? There are. There's probably... A bunch of reasons why it doesn't like that. We'll figure it out, guys. We'll figure it out. From here, it doesn't like it. Between Tambridge and... Yeah, you've got a lot to work out, haven't you? I mean, we can technically figure you out. Possibly. It might be the platform assignments. I'm, I'm a bit worried about hitting the hammer. Do it. The hammer... Says no. Try to fix all problems. Could not connect all stations. Alright. 
So what we got going on, it's fine up until Tamebridge and then what? Oh, did anybody see it? You probably did, you're like, grand, that's not going to work. <laughs> that's not going to work in a m million years. Right, there we go. Let's fix that then. Well spotted. Everybody but me. Okay, uh, uh, ch ch tick, tick, tick the tick. Do we have a, another issue like that somewhere? Probably. No, we should be good now. Possibly. We're going to need some signals, aren't we? Absolutely. Can't operate like that. One way. Absolutely. Maybe. Possibly. Do we have a missing bit of catenary there? Can't tell. No, I think we're good. I think we're good. I'd like you to go there. One way. And then I'd like you to go a bit close, isn't it? One there. The trains are not very long, so we should be okay. One there. One there. We could have double signals here. Well, we could have one there, that's for sure. I feel like that's the way that goes. And then we've got one there. And then we've got some signals. Some semaphores. All right. All right. He's, he's not going to... He's not going to do much at the moment because he's a bit broken on there he moved the catenary that's nice it's not it's a i'm a bit worried about putting signals here for the simple fact is there's a giant yard going in there with loads of connections getting in and out of the getting out of the yard but we're going to do it anyway all right we can have one there we'll figure out which ones are one way afterwards Ooh, this junction's a bit messy isn't it where on earth do we put these? <laughs> this is a is a right mess. Oh, what are you doing? You are, I yes. Oh, that's right. You're you're using the wrong one, aren't you? Or well, technically not the wrong one. Where do I put this signal? I don't want them to trip over each other if possible. I guess there would be fine. They are short trains, as I said, fairly short anyway. One here. Maybe. It's a bit close, isn't it? We'll, we'll tidy this up once uh, once it's finished tripping over. Now, Birmingham New Street. You are supposed to be... That took far too long. It says it's always issues. It could be electrification. It could be platform assignments. Let's just check. Tambridge is not the same. It needs to be one and two. That is correct. The problem seems to be between Birmingham New Street and Tambridge. That narrows it down to about everything, doesn't it? I'm a little unsure, to be fair. It could just try to be going round the wrong way. I, I, we're probably going to link it round. But if you're going into two, you... Ah, yes, that could be a problem. You're supposed to actually use 1A. I, I feel like on the return journey, sending it round here, but that means we're going to have to do some serious electrification. You know what? It's probably about time, isn't it? If we do that, can we get away with this? I mean, it would be nice. Like so. I'm a little concerned that we're going to trip over ourselves here. No. So far, you're, you're actually just doing it. Okay. Well. I mean. It's sort of working. It. Oh, you did it. You found a way in. Look at you, sneaky. There's, now it's like it wants to come in and out. But Birmingham New Street, you're on P1. Now no, it won't like it. Can we send it back out the other way so that it comes in on P1 and heads out on... No. I think I know what it is. Take this off. It, it's making it all sorts of like... I think I know what it is. When you come in on P1... You, you can't get over and we need we'd need to go up here and around uh, so we could stick it on p2 like it was how many how many trains do we have stopping at all the platforms probably a lot I'm, I'm just gonna say an awful lot let's bring them up terminals oh dear is that it? The Wolverhampton to Walsall? That is one of the trains, isn't it? Oh, we part way done that, didn't we? I'm glad I, I noticed that, because this is Birmingham New... That might work for us, right? Absolutely. So if we put this back as two, 
Can we send it round? I, I, there's no need, is there? We can just send it back out that way. Otherwise, there's no trains using this. And it seems to have figured itself out. I mean, we've got no signals going on at the moment, which I don't like, really. We should do that, shouldn't we? That's, that's just me being a little bit on the lazy side. Okay, let's put some signals in. It's not everybody's cup of tea watching me do this, but... We'll get them done fast. Oh, we're going to have to take a look at all the new trains as well. Good nurse. I'm excited. So where are we putting all those trains? Leave a comment below. I, I will do my best to try and figure out where the best... Oh, yeah, let's change those. Where the... Uh, don't delete the fence. Where the trains can go with what liver is. But uh, I'm always open to suggestions from you guys. Because half the time you know more than I do. Especially those of you who live around the area or... Or do follow the trains closer than I do. Okay, we can upgrade these semaphores, can't we? Let's get it into a as a proper network around here. We, we've still got semaphores up here. That's amazing. No, get rid of... Ooh. Are any of these used as waypoints? I don't think so. But we'll double check. Nothing heads through this... Oh, yes. <laughs> I just panicked. I just panicked. <laughs> Could you tell? I thought I deleted a waypoint then for a second. I don't know where it sent our trains. They might get a little bit lost and confused. Hopefully they don't. We've still got class 101s. I'm tempted to leave them in. Ooh. Any of you waypoints? Absolutely not. Brilliant. Let's delete these two. And then we'll we'll probably end it there. I'm sort of happy with where we've where we've gone with this today. There we go. Green signal for you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Who? Exactly. What's up with you? Oh, yes. You go all around the houses, don't you? You should be fine, though. What have I done? Have I changed one to... Yes, you can't do that, can you? Well, do you know, this will sort itself out, wouldn't it? Because after Perry Bar, you're actually going to here... And the, this might work, guys. This might work. To here, this is the one. Oh, you're not going that way. This is the one that turns round at Walsall. So you're going to be on platform three. And then you're heading back to the Bescot. Back to Tainbridge. And back to Perry Bar. Right, and you're going to need to be on... Yeah, we're going to... We get, let's pause this a second. <laughs> we get, I've got myself in a bit of a pickle. Perry Bar P2 is correct. But you want to be on P1 on the way back. That's fine. How about Tainbridge? Are you doing the right thing there? Bescot should be opposites. Walsall should be P3. What is up with you? There is no reason you can't do this, you silly sausage. What is up with you? There's no reason you should uh, trip over. You're tripping over between Aston and Perry Bar. Is that be because reasons? Have I put another... Well, no, the one-way signal shouldn't matter anymore. That shouldn't matter. Oh, you, you muppet. Of course it will matter. <laughs> oh, you, you're silly. You're absolutely silly, man. You know why that will matter, don't you? Yeah, don't add anything to this a second. That should be two-way. Goodness me. That should be two-way. There we go. That wasn't rocket science, was it? Okay, so we got that one. I noticed something. Our other train should be on P1 and 2. Or Walsall, not... Don't click on this one. There we go. This one should be... Which way is that? After blocks which you should be going to P2. And then the other way. Yes. And then you're on P1. Let's have a look at the monstrous mess of track lane we've got going there. You probably... Well, you probably do do that, to be fair. I'm not sure. Maybe. It sort of makes sense, doesn't it? I don't see why it would use the slip switch that we could put in there. That sort of makes sense to me. They kind of merge in together, don't they? I mean, you've got freight coming around the, out, around the outside. Around the outside. I could be missing a few, few switches as well. All right, guys, we're in. We're in. So our services have got a little more complex. 
and uh, we're now we're now connected via Walsall and into a Birmingham New Street and to Wolverhampton. Now, when this gets connected, we still don't use that. That is like literally a direct connection to Wolverhampton right there. And it, it, it's, it's a line. I don't know why they don't just run backwards and forwards. I guess no one travels from Wolverhampton to Walsall. I don't know. It's probably all the intermediate stops that are important. Or, no, that's, that's the only thing I can think of. There are no stops on the way, but you wouldn't need one. Maybe a couple. Maybe a couple you could have there. I, I, I believe they are contemplating opening that up. I'm not sure whether that was a thing that was ditched. Anywho, guys, we got a lot in. Do you want to have a quick look at, at the trains? I don't know. We, we don't want to put any on yet. I want to hear your feedback and your excitement for the trains that are available to us. We're, we're going to take a brief look in here. Don't want to upgrade it. By trains. If we go down all the way, we want... Uh, I believe they were all multiple units, but we're going to scroll right down to the bottom. Where are they all? Look at them all. Class 150s in various colors. Arriva Trains Wales? Oh my word, that has to be, we got first, we got Great Northern on a 150, that would be kind of nice, wouldn't it? Look at them all, regional railways, <laughs> oh, transport for Greater Manchester, I mean we're a bit far off Manchester, we're not too far, and we got to, oh, the class 142s, Pacers galore guys, Pacers galore, yes. I'm a little bit happy, if you can't tell. Right, let's end it. We, this will probably not be 45 minutes because I got carried away. But anywho, let's, uh, we're going to end with a cab ride. Someone suggested a train ride. I don't know whether you meant cab ride or train ride, as in flying next to it. Where's all of our trains? They've probably got a few issues right now. Do you know what? We'll get on this one and head into, into Wolverhampton. Right then. Oh, the UI is automatically hidden, isn't it, when you go on a cab ride? That has been episode 103. There was a lot done, as in we got uh, a new plane in. We got uh, our last steam, last freight steam train has been, has been retired. We have hooked up Birmingham New Street direct to Rugeley, uh, which, uh, which is operating as part of the the now split service to crew and originally Trent Valley. And we also got our full connection from Wolverhampton to Walsall. I believe that's a line. I don't know. I'm going to have to double check that. I don't know what I was thinking at the time. It might actually be, this one might be a very tricky one that I got planned, which is Wolverhampton to Rugeley to Birmingham International. It will do like a load of wiggly things. I'm tempted to do that with this one. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. And uh, I'm looking forward to next uh, next week. Yes, looking forward to next week, Sunday, where we'll got, we've got some brand new trains. Some class, class 150s and class 142s. Yes. With uh, lots of liveries to choose from. Really looking forward to that. And until then, take care.